everyone. I want to show you the tour of the family balcony cabin and tell you some pros and cons that I found during this cruise. For this ship class, the entrance area is a bit wider than we are used with Norwegian and during the day it receives good natural light. The first thing we notice after the refurbishment is that the carpet has been changed with a modern design that better highlights the furniture. The sofa turns into a single bed for a third person, preferably a child. It is a little bit soft, but even so, it's comfortable enough to relax. Another bunk bed for the fourth person is above the sofa. The main mirror is good in size and quality and very flat but it can be used as a vanity mirror because the LED light is mediocre. The shelf mirror comes in handy and it was very used when the desk was too crowded. I was surprised to find that after the refurbishment no USB sockets were added. A must! These are the only available in cab sockets, 110 and 220. The queen size bed is very comfortable and has new mattresses after refit. If necessary it converts to two single beds. You have a choice of hard or soft pillows and the 80 inches length will make everyone happy. I like the fact that in this cabin the bed is by the window so you can relax watching the sea. I was disappointed with the storage space. I expected the same innovative evolution as Epic which is the predecessor ship after which the breakaway was built. If you want to see the differences I have a complete review of a balcony cabin on Epic so check the link in the description down below. While it looks large enough, the closet doesn't offer good storage for a family. Two more storage cabinets are under the desk next to the minibar. The balcony is quite narrow and not enough for a family of four. This is the trend of all large ships in this cabin category. There is space for two patient chairs and a small table. The door is soundproofed but not airtight so on a gusty day you will hear the wind blowing in very loudly. The room is reasonably spacious for a family with two kids. I would say that together with two teenagers it might be crowded, but it depends on the needs of everyone related to space. I found the cabin long enough, walkable lanes with good distances between objects. The floor to ceiling windows let you enjoy the beauty of stunning views and offers an abundance of natural light due to transparent balcony shield. The bathroom has a good size, well configured and has many storage spaces for the whole family. The light is good and the mirror is even better, creating a larger space. The shower cabin is spacious and tall. A 6 foot 4 person would have no problem using it. The glass panels are partially frosted so that the rest of the bathroom can be used at the same time. The only problem I had with the sink bowl that seemed to me it was not wide enough. But overall the bathroom is well organized space. Full length mirror is close to the stage room door and under a LED light which is especially important mostly in the evening. watching our family balcony tour. If you enjoyed it, please like it and share it. If you haven't done so, click subscribe to our channel in the description down below.